Hey guys, Drifter here. Today I want to share with you a little bit of Infinite Warfare mech gameplay. And yes, you heard me correctly, there is a mech in this game. It's kind of like the one in AW, but a little bit different. Also wanted to show you a little bit of the buildup of how I earned this particular mech because it was not easy to do. And of note, I was playing against movie star Michelle Rodriguez when I was doing this, and I can hear her screaming on the other side of the stations when the mech came in. So I was very, very proud of myself. But there it is right there, the RC8 kill streak. This is the second highest kill streak in the game, but it is definitely the most coveted, the coolest, and if I'm not mistaken, I was the only person to be able to call it in today. I'm playing as the robot character right there, so you can see my robot arms just waiting for it to drop into the map. It's going to smash in through the skylight, which is really cool, and it's a big, beefy mech. Now, you can leave it alone and let it kind of protect you, but I decided to go ahead and take control. It has a directed energy weapon for its primary fire. It kind of locks on and smashes people. Even the energy has a little bit of splash damage, as you can see here. It's a little bit funny, uh, and it also has a shield that you can pull up to protect yourself. Now it doesn't have a tremendous amount of health, kind of like the AW mech, but putting up the shield allows you to deflect a lot of shots and keep it going very long. There in that clustery corridor, it did not last very long, but it is very cool. You should absolutely go for it, and if you have some teammates to protect your back, or if they want to kind of cluster up around you, it can be much, much more useful. Guys, that's all for this short video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe. Drifter out.